he for she is providing an entry point and a platform for every man who wants to give it a try and we will handhold them into taking a stand. But if they are in leadership position, we need them to take bold steps and we need them to make a change. And uh, I think there is something also about Hifushi with the support of the social media that makes it less formal, uh, for instance, as against the, the UN. So younger people are able to identify with it. techno savvy <coughs> people are able to identify with it. But what we want is for them to go beyond just that initial stage of interacting on the media uh, and they have moved off line now and actually do the actual activities on site in the community at work. So that transition from taking the first step to press that button on your computer is, is important because if you just you only stay on what you could do online and you do not leave, that's what, then it means that we're not making the progress. And that is why we have these concrete activities that we're asking companies to do, we're asking universities to do, we're asking, we're asking random individual men to do, and we are writing about the stories of the men that are doing something from a man who goes to next door and engages a man who beats up his wife and, uh, and organizes a community to actually be there for this woman. Uh, uh, boys at school who rally around girls that are being teased and regard themselves as boy he for she's in a country like Pakistan. So something Twitter was telling me that uh, because they, they are helping to monitor that uh, the conversations about he for she come from about 200 countries. Uh, all over the world. So clearly there's a footprint there that we are developing. We, we have not reached a tipping point as yet, but um, we're sure pushing, mm -hmm. we're sure pushing. Yeah. What about your own country? What about South Africa? Is so, there progress? Uh, not to the extent that I would like to do. So actually I'm going now in February to pull together a partnership uh, of a uh, on the ground, uh, he for she supporters that would work with the ministries, work with us, uh, and we are asking uh, the Nelson Mandela Foundation uh, to be the lead uh, uh, partner uh, from civil society. If we cannot uh, uh, revoke the name of Nelson Mandela to get all the men to want to do the kinds of things that he would have wanted them to do, I don't know who, <laughs> who else we can fight. 